big 501c3s because they're pretty politically involved these days too. Uh, because the C3s can't do campaign activity. So if, if C3s get involved in, say, a ballot measure and they contribute to a ballot measure, that would show up in War Star reporting. But the C3s, the, they cannot do candidate, they can't do candidate work. The C4s can. So the issue stuff is different to you than candidate specific. At this point, the bill is only dealing with the C4s because the, it's pretty limited on what the C3s can already do by federal. It's the C4s who have more flexibility, which I think is how the bill is written. But that might be a good question to ask the proponents. I'm not into the level of detail, but that would be my distinction between the C3 and C4. 